Good morning, Mr. Chairman. My name is Donald Peace. I'm a 32-year uh, uh, veteran teacher from Pasco County, Florida. Uh, I stand in opposition to this bill. Um, the parent trigger, as you're calling it, uh, started as the parent empowerment um, movement in Compton, California. Uh, this has this this turnaround process has absolutely no track record of success anywhere in the country. After the initial takeover process, um, this is going to be um, put up to a for-profit organization. The parents will be kicked to the curb because the bottom line is going to be dollars and cents, not what the parents think. It gives parents an option, it gives parents a voice, it gives parents leverage. Um, even if the, the petition process is ineffective, it's a tool that parents could have at their disposal to influence the administration and influence the school board. And I think it's important to note, uh, members of the committee, that currently under federal law um, that was passed and approved by, by our current president, there are four mandated turnaround options. So even if this bill does not pass today, if a school receives an F, they're required to take on one of four turnaround options. What we're saying by, by this bill today is that fifth option will be that the parents will have a seat at the table. It won't be decided strictly by the school board, but it'll be decided by the school board in conjunction with the majority of the parents in that failing school.